joining now from the city is France Van Kat's uh, Cyril Vanier. Uh, Cyril, uh, literally tens of thousands of people have been pouring out in this uh, unprecedented event in the capital today. Tell us more. Well, you can see these tens of thousands right around me, uh, Laura. Just take a look. This is the main, one of the main roads of Warsaw city center. It's in, uh, in front of the presidential palace. Uh, and, uh, and these are the tens of thousands of people who have come out to see their president. Now, they had been waiting for five, six, seven, eight hours down, out in the cold uh, to see his body, his coffin being brought back. And uh, that finally happened about an hour ago. And until then, and it's important to realize that, until then, this death is something that seemed almost immaterial. You know, people in the crowd had told us, we want to see our president come back home. Uh, he left uh, more than two days ago. We want to see him come back home, even if it's in a coffin. It was something that was important for the mourning process. That's the impression I got. And that happened uh, just over an hour ago when the coffin was uh, uh, driven uh, through. It was actually right in the middle of this crowd. It was driven uh, in the middle of the crowd into the presidential palace and we're waiting now to see uh, what's going to happen next and whether the crowd is going to have access to the coffin or not. Now, while he was alive, President Lekaczynski was something of a, a polarizing figure in the country. Uh, since he's died, people have really come together to, to unite in their grief. That's right. It's, it's an interesting and mixed heritage that uh, Lech Kaczynski is leaving. On the, on the one hand, uh, you know, he was one of the earliest uh, uh, advisors of Lech Walesa. He was opposed to communism in Poland from the uh, late 70s. So that's very early on in the Solidarity Movement. He was part of that movement, an advisor to Lech Walesa, as I said. And, uh, and the population of Poland, uh, you know, has not forgotten that. That is definitely one of the, the plus points uh, in, his, in his biography here. Uh, on the negatives, well, he was not a very popular president by the end of his presidency. I mean, the, the approval ratings uh, uh, going into the next presidential, the next uh, presidential election battle uh, were pretty low. Uh, there were, there were chances of him being reelected were very slim because a lot of polls feel that he, he put their country to shame on the European scene. A lot of polls do, don't feel very close to his uh, right wing conservative platform. Um, but he was, he was a divisive figure in politics during his life. But today, none of that matters. And that's what you have to realize. None of that matters right now because people aren't talking or even thinking politics. People are just in mourning. And that mourning process is still at the very, very, in the very early stages. The body, as I said, has just been wheeled in back to his home country, back to his office only an hour ago. All right. Cyril Vanier in Warsaw. Many thanks indeed for